welcome back to another episode of Dark Cloud. In the last part, we headed it off. We, we free, well, first we rebuilt all the queens. And with that out of the way, we headed back into the shipwreck uh, after retrieving a music box key from Rando's shop. And we met with the Ice Queen herself. And after a grueling high stakes battle, not really. Uh, we learned that Rando was the person that was been that was supposed to uh, marry the queen. Not quite sure how it works, but uh, yeah, we uh, <sighs> we helped them move on, and now we are in a desert because there's something going on here that we can't summon the moon ship. So we gotta investigate. Uh, off video, I went and did something. So, if you recall, there, there used to be a dark uh, uh, sword here. I think it was called Dark Cloud or something. What I ended up doing is I, I, I used my power up powers I had stored away, got to level 5. Then I status broke it and threw it in the uh, lamb sword and, um, I used, and then upgraded it to the Aunt Lamelia sword. Now, technically, this is cheating, I guess. But I had really no real intentions of using that sword to begin with. Um, and considering the fact that um, I, the attack and MP is one thing, but considering the fact that Thunder and Holy and Dino and, St and Steel, Steel is, or Metal Breaking especially, are still red, I would have been probably upgrading this shit for an eternity. <laughs> so I decided to just leave it, um, especially with Metal Breaking. I only have I've only got two metal breakers throughout the entire game so far, which would have been very, very bad. <laughs> so I decided to leave it. Dino Slayer too. I haven't really got many Dino Slayers. So yeah, I decided to leave it. So uh, we just can't rely on Tona's heavily because uh, Tona's going is incredibly overpowered now. You'll see how, how powerful he is. I haven't seen it yet, but we'll see. We'll find out together. Which gives me incentive to focus on other characters too, like you know, Zhao, Goro, can eat a dig, Ruby. I'm gonna need her level at some point. Alright, so this is what I'll actually give her that fucking amulet too. That amulet did not serve me any purpose at all. Thanks, amulet. I also wonder, I also wanted to see if I was missing any uh, fruits of Eden and gourds, which I have a feeling I have, considering I should have 140 HP for everybody, and uh, whatever gourd level everybody's at, uh, I can't. What's that? Seven or eight? Or no. Like, uh, eight or nine or something like that? Everyone should have ma evened out gourds and l HP levels, but I'm missing one gourd and I'm missing two fruits of Eden, so I'm, I'm missing. I feel like I'm missing some items. Alright, so this is what we're dealing with. Yeah, a little. a little too much. A little. just a little too strong. So, yeah. Can't really use Tone. So, uh... Well, obviously I use Tone for Atla, but... Which is fine. I don't really have to focus on worry about Tone stuff, I guess. That's one person I don't have to worry about. I wish we had a Ruby. Because really, I'm not gonna really... There's... There really is no use to Xiao. Uh, Ruby's gonna have some purpose, some use later on, though. But I need to get. Oh, let's. I got a key. I'm not sure what the back room item is in this place. I don't remember. I think it's like a stone slab or something. But uh, pretty much everybody's weapons are gonna need some uh, attention at some point, especially when it, before I get to the final boss. Which, if I'm f super far behind, I'll probably just end up. Uh, be using the glitch and then status breaking it and throwing it into another weapon. Go away! We'll see how things 
stand before I fight the final boss. Hey look, I got I got one out of six refunded. Uh, if I could find more, that'd be great. Status broke. I just can't run and tell him. That is the gate key. the stupid thing. Uh, okay, so attack is settled, so I just need holy. I just need holy. Nice. Wait, what route was it going? Oh, it had been up, yeah. So I just need holy, and I can upgrade this. Nice. special about this place. Alright, 
there's that sunk key right off the bat. Nice. Is this the door? Knock it down in a second. Looks like there's a jaw to jump over right here. some cabins. Thanks to the map, it's pretty much all but complete. place. Until we hit a roadblock. 
as per usual. that I can get. So I'm definitely gonna need Ruby for the final fight in a, of a game. There's just no way around it. I think I never really touched Ruby. When I very first played through, I never touched Ruby, so when I got to the final fight in the game, I really couldn't do anything because Ruby wasn't leveled up. I don't think I don't think a lot of my characters. I don't think any of my characters really leveled up. We're geared up, I should say, since there's really no levels in this game. Wait, what's all? Let's say, where the fuck's the exit? It's over here. I don't see it mapped out. Cause I haven't been there yet. All right. Here. Here we go. 
Come on, Ungaga. What's happened to you? I heard that Ungaga is the strongest warrior in the, in the whole Muska, Muska Desert. Maybe he used to be, but not anymore. He failed to protect the village. He's no longer a warrior. He's weak now. Hmm. You know what? Being strong in one of the, uh, in a, being strong and on the battlefield and being truly strong as a person are not the same, are they now? What do you think of Tone, when who's with me? What do I think? I don't understand. I sense something very strong from that person, like a will, a power deep within him and his heart. I don't know exactly what it is. Yes, Tone is strong. I am weak. Oh boy. Well, he tried. That's all that matters is that he's trying. Oh, these things. These things are a little annoying. Not too hard to deal with. But, uh. Oh, good. Got a hornet coming after my ass. Go away, hornet! Not interested in being stung. Where the fuck can I leave my bug spray at? Tasty water. The bare minimal minimal of waters. Why don't I have so many bombs? Feather drop in a while. 
over my chest. Guess the game finally gave up and trying to give me them. program a backroom item I know I think that was the final dungeon or, or, or was it this one I really I don't remember I think it was the I think it was the final dungeon didn't mean to do that great So one of these are one of these got to be a mimic. Creamy water. Sure. Yeah. Knew it. The treasure room. switching. It's kind of annoying, honestly. It's probably one of the biggest flaws this game has. It's all the menu work and all, this, all the switching that you gotta do. That's why, that's why I prefer Dark Cloud 2. It's a lot more simplified. Any monsters in here? Like chess. Mimics. It's the Mimic floor, apparently. Seconds like yes. I'm gonna dip out of this dungeon real quick and check out my uh, storage real fast after this floor. See if I have any holies. Let's see if I can buy any more holies. Of it, the lack of inventory space. Your overall inventory will increase, but not your attachments. And I'm pretty sure pocket doesn't affect them. Let me get out of here real quick and get some. Uh... Well, I can check around here if there's any chance it spawned. I don't think so. Let's see them. Of course, there's, other, there's an other house out there as well. I can, I can check. Where can I go? All right, over oh, right here. Aha! Oh, right there too. Oh, there's, oh, there's that gourd that I was, mi or a gourd that I was missing. All right, well, I'll use it. To uh, tap out Ruby, so everyone has at has, 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 the right has all the gourds at least so far. But I'm convinced that I've missed one. Let me go over here real quick. The Muscaraca Village, well, the village that will soon to be. Check out this lonely house over here.
And I think chests can spawn around here too. Can I go over here? I can. Chests can spawn over here as well. There's nothing here. What about in this house? I was wondering when their moves going to kick in. Aha! Gourd! Alright. I'm gonna save all the gourds and fruits of eat. Oh, well, I should really use the fruits of eat, honestly, for uh, Zhao and uh, Goro. We gotta look around like everything. Make sure you grab all the chests, all the miracle chests. Oh, I see one. No! Day 27! I've been, on, I've been on this adventure forever! Is that fish candy? Alright, you know what? I'm not really gonna care for this defense dip boost at this point. I'll get what I get is what I get. Oops. Oh, took that. Yes! Seven! I think I have to get lucky. Alright, let me take a quick trip to the room real fast. See if I can a holy sort of way. I can't remember if I do or not. If not, let's see if I can buy some from, uh, old, from old Gaffa. I think, I think old Gaffer has holies that I can buy. Do I have any holies in here, lady? Uh, doesn't look like it now. I have wind. That's not going to do any good. All right. Let me check old Gaffer Spice real fast. Plus, also sell some shit in my inventory while I'm here. Uh, oh, I can't buy holies from me. Yes! Got so much Gilda! It's unreal! Shove them away because my my uh, storage is full too. I'm not concerned about endurance ones because I, I can always buy more endurance ones if I really need to from uh from uh fighting wateries. So I can buy the level I can buy the level ones of uh, endurance attack speed and P I will buy those buy three of those all right Plus, I can always buy endurance ones here as well, so I'm not concerned about endurance ones and attack ones. Uh, I need to... Alright. Oh, well, that's fine. That's fine. Alright. Back to... Plundering the temple. Oh, good. This is a limited zone? Goro. Oh my god. 
bad. Alright, Gora, what can I do for you? I mean, you're pretty strong as it is, but you're just so fucking slow. Alright, I gotta find the exit key and get out your ASAP. Good, mimic. Goro's strong, but I don't like Goro. I'm gonna go this way. Considering there's a fucking door there. Just part of Wow, that took a lot of endurance. God, it's a mimic floor. Okay, I got the exit key. Getting the fuck out of here. I don't care whatever else is in here. Goodbye. Fuck this floor. Alright, Goro. Get out of here. That would happen. Hey, head itches. These headphones are making my head itch. Uh, ice. Need to cool down. Oh, okay, guy. All right, guy. Bitch, bait you into that. How fitting I get fire. Chest! Bandit slingshot! This is, I think this is the time where I can normally get them now. Higher chance, at least. Wow, curse. Don't get that often. Oh, it's a slingshot, but it's not the slingshot that I want. Game, please, why are you doing this to me?
back up, Lenny. I just sold some soap and I got so bad. The game's trying to tell me something, isn't it? Mm. Oh man. The Pharaoh's curse is a bitch. Oh. Okay. What is it? Thunder? Yeah, it's thunder. Slayer. I can now buy ghosts, so it's not that's nice. Un or not ghosts, it's undead. I can now buy that, so that's nice too. So I'm good in those departments. And fire, thunder, wind, and holy. I can pretty much, I think I could buy all those actually. So, you know, I think I'm pretty good in these departments. But since holy's come along more, um, I might have just. Try to put more stuff in a holy. Focus more holy. Right. I mean, honestly, what I should do. I have like no fucking rings for her at all. That's the problem. So even if I wanted to status break this and put this, it's not gonna do me any good. I have no fucking rings for her. So I can't status break a weapon into it. I was hoping I would get the bandit ring, but I almost said that's not gonna happen. Considering the bandit ring, I'm more, I'm more yet. Well, kind of sort now. Oh, whatever. Man, if I had the bandit's ring, I could, I could skip the next upgrade stage, which is the goddess ring. Um, uh, but uh, I'm, 
obviously I don't have it, so I can't I can't I can't skip the crystal ring stage. Which fucking sucks. Ungaga, can I ask you something? I'm listening. Ungaga, you are a warrior. What does a warrior fight for? I made a note to fight for Michaela. Michaela? Michaela? Michaela. Michaela. But I failed to save Michaela. Michaela? Ungaga, is she the one you care for? Michaela is my fiance. I loved her. Michaela is dead? She disappeared with the, with the village. Oh, I see. So that's why you're so down. Well, let me tell you. I assure you Michaela is alive. Is... Is that true? Probably. Oh, look! Shooting star! Lucky Cookie Zucchini! Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. That's my reaction, too, guy. Just gotta keep diving into these floors. We'll get there eventually. We'll get there eventually. What the fuck is this? Oh, God. It's a hermit! Crabby Hermit! It's probably the thunder, if anything. Ah. Go away! The developers fucked up on never programmed the back room key. I can't remember if it was this dungeon or if it was the final dungeon. I really can't remember. Bitch. Gilda drops. Honestly, I don't need Gilda anymore. I really don't. Gilda in this game is not as important as, as it is in the second game. The second game, you need Gilda. Because Gilda is linked to Giorama. Because unlike this game, you have to actually buy resources in order to, do, to build Giorama stuff. Rather than just have it available right from the get go and have. A certain amount. You have to actually buy materials. And that can be quite costly. Via. Where's the chest at? The fuck is it? Where is Oh my god. Blend in so well. Or I'm, a, or I'm just blind. Probably a little bit of both. 
God damn, this game is... The stage has been very generous with that one. It's like, I don't know, it was, it was only like two or three at one, you know. They really spread out the atlas from this dungeon so far. Oh, nice. I can level it up. Treasure room, so there's gotta be mimics in here. Lots of them, yep. Mimic one. Kayla? I feel like I got to this floor from the roadblock.
Yes. This floor... And the next floor is our roadblock, so we'll head out of here and build some Georama. And we'll call, wrap up this part. single enemy in each floor. Wait, did I get it? No, I thought I picked it up! God damn it. Fuck me. I could have sworn I picked the fucking thing up. Never mind. We're going back for the fight. Hey, Bomberman, I'm back. First, before I go off into the village, 
Let me take a trip around here. Aha. Thanks. Anti goo amulet. Appreciate it. Appreciate it! Oh my god. And the smart thing would have would have been would have, I would I should have done is probably made, found the list of miracle miracle chests and checked off the ones I grabbed so I'll know which ones I grabbed which ones I didn't. I would probably would have been the smart thing to do at the very beginning of the, of the playthrough, but I'm not smart and I didn't think that far ahead. All right, before I even put any houses down, let me take one more look around here. There's two chests here. Nice. Oh my god. Fluffy donut. Uh, which parfait? Alright. Oh, that's not it. That's not it either. I'll take that. That too. Seven. Nice. Uh, any chests lying around here? I don't think I know how to find. I always saw them. It's pretty easy to find them around here. No. Uh. Nope. Nothing around there. Take a look at this guy's house. Anything I can't see? No. Okay. All right. Let's get some Giorama done. <sighs> I can't remove that, can I? I cannot. That's stuck. That's permanently stuck to the field. All right. Jabubu. Stirring up th things up. My name is Jibubu. Please, be, please, pleasure to meet you. How'd you hear me about me when you're stuck in a, when you're stuck in a, uh, in a floating sphere? What do you need for your home? Can you place the hay up the roof from the, by the house? Oh, and don't forget about the totem. Okay, easy enough. Jibubu's house is complete. Why? I don't understand. Why? Why? Okay, drama, drama queen. Oh? Hi there. Looking at my house, but turned to normal, I just felt like screaming. Say, why don't you come in? Better than you screaming to the heavens. I really appreciate this. Thanks to you now, I can live my ordinary life again. This is to show my gratitude. What is it? Ooh, fruit of Eden! Yes, I'll take that! By the way, have you noticed something seems wrong here? The aesthetic sense I have here in Muscalaka... First of all, it's Mus Muscaraca, according to the map. It's not very good. That Ungaga is regarded as handsome and desirable. And I'm regarded as plain looking? Shouldn't they take a better look at me? I mean, come on! What is the definition of beauty, anyway? What, is such, does such a thing really exist? No, because it's derived from people's personal views. Therefore, the one who is seen as beautiful by more people is beautiful. But wait, that means I'm plain looking after all. No, they can't be. Okay, guy. You need to calm down. Oh boy, he's at it again. Why? I'm sorry, guy. I don't, can't help you there. For another fruit of Eden, nice. You're hoarding the fruits of Eden from me, guy. Cheese. How can you get these two? Dijau. 
and then... Where's the other Fruit of Eden? There it is. Alright, so I'm not going to use any more Fruits of Eden until Angaga joins us. Same with the Gourds, so I'm going to start stockpiling those. Sister of the three sisters. Nice to meet you. How can I fix your house? Can you install a, a cabinet so it's, it's, it's just for st Ugh. Excuse me. It's just for storage space, but it will really help. Sure. Undead Buster. Set some ice. What about you? How do you do? Welcome to Mus Muska Raka. Not Muska Laka. I don't know which is which, honestly. I'm Akara, the baby of the three sisters. It's a pleasure to meet you. How can I fix your home? Please keep the tradition of the pole guardian. I don't want to have anything bad happen to us. I guess that makes sense. Okay, I already talked to you. That's a drama queen. Uh, Nothing. Where's the where's the where's the other sister? Where's the elder? Uh, where you at, lady? Did I talk to you? Makara? Where the fuck you at? Devia? Where the fuck's your sister at? I did. That's why I couldn't find her because I went to the wrong fucking house. Jeez. Mage Slayer. Gord. Anything else around here? I already talked to you. Nikita. You! What do you want from this village? I'm... I'm Nagita, the eldest of three sisters. Don't you forget that. I'm here to fix your village. Be snippy with me. I put many of my dresses in my odds and ends case that I was placed on top of the roof. Don't forget that. Alright, I won't. collect his reward already. Sorry, I can't help you. Shall I give you some candy, dear? No, I'm, I'm good. I have candy in my storage. Oh, sis. Tony didn't come here for that. Don't be mean. Oh, did you hear that? Here we go again. The car has got a bad habit of, of vilifying people. I didn't mean that. I didn't, I didn't mean it in a... I didn't meant that. Meant it in that way. I... Stop it, both of you. The two of you are always fighting lately. Oh, hey, Tungaga. Makara, you're alive. Did you say Michaela before? Tungaga. Uh-oh, not this guy again. Makara, I'm really glad that you're still with us. I really am. I'm happy too, Tungaga. 
Ugh. Let's see what's going on here. Please, not here. No mushy stuff. Angaga, you tell me. Why Makara? I'm better at everything than Makara, so why not me? Makara, Makara, Makara. Always Makara. Tell me, why is that? There are things Makara does better than you, Nagita, so she's the one who I want to be with. Okay, fine. Let me ask you something. What does Makara do better than me, exactly? Okay, I'll tell you all. Aha! At last, the secret will be known! It was a year ago. I was stung by a scorpion. This is it. I'm finished. The scorpion sting. I will die. I mean, scorpions can be pretty fucking vicious, especially if they're poisonous. What's the matter? Sungaga, are you alright? Nagita. The scorpion got me. I won't live much longer. I'll call a doctor right away. Stay here. No time. Stay, Nagita. Don't want to die like this. Hi. I'll call a doctor. Stay here. Oh boy. Mr. Ngaga? Mr. Ngaga? Master Ngaga, what are you doing here? The scorpion got me. I will die soon. Stay by me for a while, Makara. I won't last much longer. My last wish. Stay, Makara, by dying, Ngaga. Thank you, Makara. Oh! Ha! <laughs> got slapped. Silly, you're the strongest warrior in the desert. We'll be we'll protect Muska Rock Laka when you're done when you're gone. Scorpion's venom. Nothing can be done. I'm dying. Mr. Ngaga. We need you here in Muska Laka. And I need you too. Oh. Is she even stuck in the poison out? That's very unsafe! What are you doing? Don't do that, Makara. You'll kill yourself. Stop, Makara. This Muskalaka needs you. And I need you, too. You know, that's very unsafe. You should not suck out the poison from a scorpion or anything in general. Do not do that. It's very unsafe. Makara sucked the poison from me and she became infected. Makara was dying and fought for three days. Makara risked her life to save me. If it weren't for Makara, I probably would've, wouldn't be here. Really? So that's what happened. Makara has incredible courage. No one can match it. Not even me. I fell in love with Makara. Hmm, now I see. So that's why Makara was lying there. Was lying there too when I brought the doctor to you. And Makara probably asked Ungaga not to say anything about it, huh? Well, I guess... Makara, I admit it. I could never have acted as bravely as you did. You are the one for Ungaga. There's really no room for me between you two. Sis. Nagita, thank you. Oh my god, lord. Tone, take me with you and we'll beat that evil wizard. I understand now what Theo was trying to say. I forgot this. Real strength doesn't come from your fists. It comes from your heart. Your heart. Theo and Makara help me remember that. Ungaga will try once more to become the strongest warrior. Alright. All right. Ungaga's become an ally. Yes! I'll be with Makara for just a while, Tone. You go ahead and I'll catch up with you. You do that, buddy. I gotta, I gotta see what's inside this house, see if there's any miracle chests. Oh, we're not done here yet. Oh, hey, Theo. Tone, I couldn't help overhearing outside. So Ungaga's back to normal. I really wanted Ungaga to get back to his old self again. I'm really glad. No, it's okay. I'll say goodbye to Ungaga from here. If we talk too much, it may be hard for me to go back to the village. It's the end of my mission here. I'm sure Ungaga will be a great help on your quest, Tone. So long. Okay. Bye, guy. Oops, I almost forgot. Sent to the last chamber where the moonship is kept, you need both the Sun Signet, which is kept by Sand Warriors, and the Moon Signet, which we Moon People control. I believe that the Sun Signet has been passed down from years to the village chiefs. 
The problem is the moon signet, which was supposed to be kept by us. Nem doesn't like little hassles, so he left it with the sand warriors so they could manage the entire temple. Oh, but please don't blame Nem. Managing a tomb is hard work. Ah, I can believe that. Anyway, both of them are kept by the vil people of this village. Remember now you need both signets to enter the last chamber. Because you're worthless. So I guess this is all I have to say. First, you guys let the moon orb get away. You sell the moon orb by accident, and now you couldn't even hold on to some stupid signet? My god. Make sure you beat that wimpy genie. I don't know, beat you guys. Fuck. Why am I helping the moon? Why am I. Fucking moon people. Uh, is there any more chests lying around that spawned in? No. Okay. Alright. Let's take out Ungaga. Let me take a look at stuff. He's so far behind in everything. Gourds, especially. Alright. Next house. Nice to meet you. You're from a new village, right? I can tell easily. How could you tell? Could you attach a storage cabin? I have many things I had stashed there. All right, I'll do that. There's that gourd. One of the gourds I need. What do you have in your house? Bring me chicken. Anything back here? Nope. Fruit of Eden. I could give that to uh, Gaga. Oh, I had another gourd. Where did I get this fucking gourd from? Oh, shit. Open up my, uh... Alright. The last storage cabin. Aha! There you are. Today I'll have something I wanted to tell you. Come over here. When I first saw you, I knew right away who you were. You were the son of the warrior of, of the warrior Aga. Huh. Aga once came to Muskalaka. When I first saw him, I sensed something special in him. Aga was an amazing man. Something about him drew everyone to his side, just like you now. He fought well, especially with the soul with swords. He told me he was make, making a journey to find an amazing treasure. I don't know if he ever found it or not, but when he visited here again, he let the go would let the golem ghost gay here. You said you were on a quest to defeat the Dark Genie. Your father left you a tip for defeating him. I think Aga knew this day would come. The entire purpose of his journey would could have been exactly for that. I believe or I really believe that's true. I have faith in you. You can do it. Yes, I really do believe you can defeat the Dark Genie. Here, take this. Ooh, tech three, yes. And I do have a stock of some items here. Not much though. Take them in your adventure. Oh, but I have to charge you for them. I have to earn a living, you know. Take care. So long. I guess that makes sense. Merchants gotta make a living. Oh, anything in here? Uh, no. Hey, guy. What do you got? Uh, I can buy not. I can now buy sky shit, so that's nice. I can buy stone breakers. I can buy premium reminder uh, healings. That's it, huh? Man, great. I should sell these bombs. This shit out of my inventory. I sell the cheese too. I don't need the fucking cheese. I don't need these. I don't need those. I don't need any of this. All right, I'm good. All right. Uh, 
shove this down. Got some totems. Got some stairs, and I had no prisoners, so I can't shove anybody in there. Uh, anything around? Only one chest, huh? Great. So a cozy cell. All right. I don't know if anything appears around the totems. I could shove them down and find out. Oh, they do. Dead Buster. Right. The Oasis. Plop this down. This is nice. Fruit of Eden. I'll take it. Mighty Healing. I'll take that. Those are, not, those are nice to have, especially when you have a lot of health. I need these, so... Uh, throw that out. Let's let the fuck the fire. I'll probably spend more fire later. No problem. Uh, fruits of Eton. Alright. Ungaga's getting out there. Uh, do I have anything else to put down besides roads and trees? I have nothing! Alright. Going so far good with Giorama, though. I'm already pretty much almost done with the Giorama. Right? I'm halfway done with the Giorama building already. Alright, I'm going to save it here. Uh, when we come back... We will continue our uh, dive into this temple. See if we can't find the uh, the Pharaoh's treasure or whatever the fuck we're looking for. And build more Giorama. So, I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next part. Later.